Sometimes you want to stop a convoy of enemy supplies without a full-scale assault. If you could plant a time delay device, for instance, in two or three vehicles up front here, you could at least upset the enemy's time schedule. The Firefly is specially designed to do just such a job. You use it to attack gasoline-driven vehicles through their fuel tanks. Fireflies will be shipped to you in the field in this sealed tin, which looks like a coffee can. Open the tin with the key, which comes attached to the bottom. You'll find the unassembled parts for four fireflies. Triggering mechanisms, which delay the explosion until the firefly has soaked in the gasoline for about two hours. Detonators for the explosive. Charge cups. They hold the explosive, which blows a hole in the gasoline tank and sometimes sets the gasoline afire. Here's the way to assemble them. First, take the charge cup. There's a cap and plug in one end of it to prevent accidental explosion during shipment. You won't need this part anymore. Unscrew it and throw it away, or hide it if you're already in enemy territory. Next, take a detonator out of the wooden packing block. Insert it in the charge cup with the open end pointing out. Then, screw the triggering mechanism into the charge cup. Since the gas tanks of many vehicles are divided into two compartments, have two fireflies ready so you'll be sure of knocking out your target. Charge cup. Detonator. triggering mechanism. You can easily conceal both fireflies in your clothes. Don't be afraid if you drop a firefly or fall with them on you. They aren't likely to blow up when this happens. Now for a look at some of your most common targets. First, a Jap tractor. In this vehicle, the gas tank is under the front seat and is divided into two separate compartments. The intake on the driver's right opens directly into the section containing the main supply of gasoline. A screen in the opening seemed at first to furnish an obstacle, but it proved to be removable. In such a case, Firefly can easily be dropped in after the safety pin is removed. The intake directly under the driver goes into the section of the tank which contains the reserve supply only. There didn't happen to be a screen in this one, but it's probably safe to assume there was one originally. These Jap trucks have already served their usefulness as targets for our guns in actual battle. But now we study their vulnerability to other methods of attack. As far as the Firefly is concerned, the situation is much the same as in the tractor. Gas tank under the seat, but only one intake. No obstructions here either. So you just pull the safety pin and let go of Firefly into the tank. Target, Jap motorcycle. The main thing is to be sure to distinguish the difference between the oil and gas intakes. 
two gas intakes here, but we didn't find anything inside to bar the passage of the firefly into the tank. Next target, Jap staff car. The opening of the intake pipe is free from obstacles, but the pipe is so long you can't see far into it, so check with a stick. We discover there's a right angle bend which would probably keep Firefly from sliding all the way into the tank. In a case like this, don't try to use Firefly because it won't work unless it has a chance to soak in the gasoline itself. Last target, a Jap Jeep. Since there's nothing in the intake to block passage into the tank, pull out the safety pin. Let the firefly drop into the tank and put back the cover. To destroy the whole gas tank, a firefly would have to be put in the other intake too, since close inspection showed that each intake led into a completely separate compartment of the tank. The actual effect of Firefly is demonstrated with an expendable Jeep. The exact time Firefly will take effect depends upon the temperature of the gasoline. Warmer temperature, shorter time. Colder temperature, longer time. The Firefly has been planted in each intake. The first one blows. Then the second, emptying the two sections of the gas tank. In each instance, one end of the tank was blown out at the seam where it was joined to the sides. In addition to destroying enemy fuel, Firefly may occasionally start a fire, but you'll find its chief effectiveness is in stalling enemy vehicles where it may be difficult or impossible to get replacements. Don't expect sensational explosions from Firefly. Remember, it's a special weapon for a special purpose, to disrupt enemy supply lines by attacking gasoline vehicles of all kinds. When you have done that, you have helped to destroy the enemy. <laughs>